what's up guys it's your boy lupe here back with another crossing wood video uh today's crossing wood video i just want to go over um you know the, the the new event that came out on the crossing void it's been like i say like maybe um it's been like one week already i think since it came out but you know after a week i just want to go over it you know and you know just show you and just show and show y'all my progress which i think should be optimal for everybody or i guess say it like that you know so you know, I guess if if you know if people are wondering if y'all if y'all are doing it right and stuff like that and just compare it to mine, you know. So right here, the you know, the event, it's basically you know I guess it's like kind of like one of those little, uh, games from the app store you know where you build like your little town. It's, it's kind of something like that. So basically right here you know this it's called Food Ward you know the culinary showdown, uh you know. And, and every day it updates your venue to show you how much coins you got. You know, I got 72, 72k yesterday. Oh, uh, last night, I guess. And that's a B tier. You know, I'm, I'm surprised. I guess, I guess, I guess you got to get a lot, which, which will happen though. So, um, so, so when you start off, you get three buildings. Well, you get a ticket and you get to build three buildings. So, what I recommend, well, I'm sure everybody has done this already, but you know, try to make, try each ticket get each building at first then after that just upgrade each one of them one by one to level two for all three of them and then after that go to level three as you can see then after then after that when you get your another ticket go to level four like for this one right here and for the tickets you get them from here as you can see i need two more and they actually cost a lot uh it took me like it takes me like one day each to get one ticket it takes you i estimate it takes you at least one day to get each 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 ticket as long as you like refresh your stalls and I'll get that I will get to that later. So um these are the tickets right here. I already bought them, you know, three tickets, three tickets, and um I think that's one ticket right there. So um right here we have the rewards, of course. They're pretty good. So all uh, right right off the bat, don't get the rewards at all. You wanna wait. You want to get all the tickets after you get all the tickets and and well you know after you get all the tickets and upgrade your stalls then you can start getting the rewards because you want to get your tickets first because to get i think to get all the rewards for what for you know from what i heard from my um from my guild apparently from for my discord i guess that you need to get all the um like 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 all your stalls level fours to get all the to get all the you know rewards i guess and i guess it's i guess it's true because it's been like, let's say, um, see, it's, it says 14 days left. I think we started off with like 25 days and it's been like a whole, it's been like whole seven days and, and, and I haven't bought nothing at all. I just been like grinding my stalls and, and my chefs, which I'll get to that in a bit. There's a lot to get to. So right now, you know, missions, you get a lot of good rewards here. You know, just keep grinding your characters and, you know, we, we, you know, of course we got some soul origins, but it's only one kind of sucks, you know. You get some, hmm, ooh, it looks like there's new rewards I haven't seen, but these are for Master Chef, and I'm and, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm I i do not know how to do it, but I I'll, I'll try to go over in the video and show y'all, you know, how I suck at it. So, for my stall right here, you know, level three means you get three chefs to get, you know, when you get it to level four, you get four chefs. You know, the best way to get the most coins out of your chefs is that each chef has their category. So let's say for right here, you know. Uh, well, I don't want to swap one yet, but look, I'll show you right here. So basically, um, these chefs right here, it's called like, I guess the, you know, there's, there's different. See, I'll sh it says right here. Let's see. Uh, I should say, I guess not, but, 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 but you can tell when the, when one of your chefs are over, it will show you the, right here so as you can see uh, my bad i keep saying oh uh, uh, uh. so right here i got all my three chefs the best way to get the most coins is try to upgrade the chefs with with the most food that has bonus on it that goes to each stall you know each stall has two categories that 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 ha that gives them bonus and and each chefs have their special unique talents for that i guess so like for um uh, mal he's pretty goaded on this station right here, you know, the Colorado you have it or whatever, I think it's called. 
you know, you know, uh, you know, uh, he, you know, he has two bonuses. You know, like I said, he's pretty goaded. Also in the two, uh, her level four is not a bonus though, but you know, just just having her level, her, you know, her her level three, right here, is is pretty good still, and you uh, are two. So, you know, for the best way to get coins, what I'm trying to just say is that try to get, try, like as you can tell, everything here is bonus. Just try to get bonus at here and most, and try to get like the the third level bonus because that's the best one. And I guess the fourth one is the best, but you need you need level four chefs, which I'll show you right here. So the chefs have five; they can get up to level five, but level five is like the you know I get I, I'm still new to the game, but you know I guess these like new little well it's not new, but you know these little tokens you can get in the shop and buy stuff. But level four is it takes you pretty long, but I'm, I'm pretty I'm pretty close to it. You know I got like eleven level chefs. What you want to do is kind of work on your chefs. And just trying to grind them up, treat them equally, you know. Uh, there's a few, there are a few chefs that I kind of neglected, but you know, it's you know, it's it's kind of whatever because they're I think they're pretty useless. They're, they 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 do not do that really good because they don't got any they, they don't got really good bonuses. But of course you, but of course in the long run, when I get everything level four, I'm going to have to be forced to juice them. So it's kind of whatever. But what you do want to do is try to get like at least eight level chefs level four try to get eight chefs you know your eight characters to level four to get this soul origin it's only one but still something you know oh and um try your best to like get on you know i kind of hate how the game kind of forces you to um log into the game and try to get you know and and you know it kind of forces you to log on like every four hours or eight hours or 12 hours to what you put your um you know your food stuff to you know, just to refresh your stalls. You know, that's the only thing I got to tell y'all. Uh, try to refresh your stalls as much as you can. Uh, save your, you know, save all your coins for tickets at first and after that rewards. And try to upgrade all your chefs. You know, don't focus on only on one character and stuff like that. Then for food, each chef uses different food for their plates and stuff. And this is the events you get it from. You know, right here, you know, you, you know. Well, I reckon them, you know, well, I'm still kind of, you know, I, I, there's some events I couldn't three-star. There's probably more better teams I can use, but I'm, I'm kind of stubborn. I like using the same team, which is kind of bad for this game because there's like a meta where there's like, they, like basically using like different teams is better, but and I, I don't really care to be honest. You know, I, I like using my, my team consider of like mostly like characters from Railgun, which I, I prefer. So, um, right here, I, I, I recommend to at least have at least over 10k of each food. And you and you will never run out. Trust me. At least waste some of your stamina every day on food. At least have around 10k, and you should be good. As you can see here, I have one. I have one fifty k soy sauce. And the reason why is because when the event ends, we have a recycling that's not open yet. It opens when it's over, and it opens. You know, it, and, and and when the event is over, I guess, and all the and, and all the leftover ingredients, I guess you can recycle it. But I kind of heard from my my guild again from from my Discord that it might just be coins, which kind of sucks. So you know it's kind of a letdown. Hopefully it's not. Hopefully we get some like good rewards like these, at least some XP bottles, like something like that. You need a lot of them for upgrading my equipment. So um, what else? Um, oh yeah, and I guess for these accessories right here, which are new, I kind of just noticed them right now. Um, you get them from Master Chef, I guess. This is this here. I don't think this is open yet. Yeah, it's not open yet. The theater year. I don't, I don't know what that is yet. Probably make another video on that. Um, this is Master Chef. You know, you cook for you know, you cook for the old great uh, Gordon Ramsay, I guess, from America. I don't know. Nah, I'm kidding. He's probably. Like, I think he's from England. I don't know. So, looks like the highest scores are six thousand. I'll show you how much I suck at this. All right, so uh, so I'm, I'm gonna make a dish. Satisfy level. I think you want to try to get. Ooh, I don't know. Score. I'm gonna try this guy. I don't know what that means. I think the higher it is, the better. But I think I kind of. I think I kind of. I think I'm kind of stuck here. But, but I'll, we'll try our luck. Uh, we'll use. He wants a hamburger. So let's see. What kind of hamburgers are there? Looks like there's only one hamburger, which is her. All right. So yep, we're gonna consume that. We're gonna choose our ingredients. Like right, that. Choose this. So 
So I guess you, I guess you want to try to use the best items, you know, from like I guess it's like legendary purple or whatever. I don't know. I don't know what they're called. Now let's just try it. Let's cook it. Oh no! Did, oh no! I, I did the wrong dish. Yeah, I did the wrong dish, bruh. I choked so bad. Hold up! Hold up! I'll do it again. Hold up. That's that was that was the wrong dish. Damn it! I don't got enough. Uh, let's just do that. And this. I don't know how it works to be honest. Kind of suck. I'm kind of stuck at it. Alright, let's try this. Oh no. Keep getting a sucky score. Why? I think it's decreasing. Let's try another chef. Let's see. Uh, she's strict. She's strict. She's strict with daily nutrition. So I guess. From looks of it, she likes this. We're gonna uh, put her with her. Oh yes, I think she she should be good. Oh, not her, not her. Oh, let me see. Yeah, this right here. Oh, we got a lot of soy sauce. Oh, this this might be a good one. I actually feel pretty. I feel pretty lucky about this one here. Oh yeah. I right, I feel pretty lucky about this one. I, I feel like it might be my highest high score right here. Oh no, never mind, I suck. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how it works to be honest. I need to talk to my guild in Discord to see how this works and get tips from it. And I'll probably make another video on this when this comes out right here, the theater year. But you know, that's pretty much it. Uh yeah, I just recommend just to grind your um tickets, you know, get all your stalls up, and that, then after that, just like grind away to get the rest of the rewards. And and don't forget to level up your chefs e equally and try to like Try to log in as much as you can, you know, try to get the points and stuff, you know. I know it kind of sucks, but it's whatever, you know. The game kind of forces you, but, you know, it's whatever. Yeah, that's pretty much it for the video. Hope y'all enjoyed the Crossing World video, and I'll catch you next time. Peace, guys.